Ladies and gentlemen, I want to present for you one of our favorite Ickle Pickle products, so much that I do this in almost every show that I perform without exception. And so that's about 20 times a month in schools, in churches, for kids, for grown-ups, for whoever. This is a great trick. Uh, it's kind of foolproof. It doesn't take very much practice to learn it, and it's one that's going to leave them talking. And so I have some cards here. They're actually color-coded with different phrases. It is two duplicate packs, and I'm going to get to the center, which has an inverted card, our key card, which says Magic Time Now is Happening. And we're going to put that right there so that the audience can read it. In an actual show, you'd probably put it on a, uh, a plate stand or something like that. And so now I'm going to take one pack and give it to Glenda, who's helping me today, and then I'll take the other pack. And we're going to play a little spelling game to shuffle the cards. And I'll let Glenda be in charge of the shuffling so that I don't know the position of any of the cards. And here's how we're going to do that. We're going to spell the words, Magic Time Now is Happening. Every time that I say a letter, one of us will move a card from the top to the bottom. But like I said, Glenda is in charge. And so the first word is magic. First letter is M. Glenda, do you want that one or you want me to take it? I will take it. Okay, so one card to the bottom for M. How about the A? I'll take it. Okay, how about the G? I will take it. All right, and how about the I? You take it. I'll take the I. How about the C? You take it. Very good. And remember, the spectator is legitimately in complete control the whole time. They can do absolutely whatever they want, and the trick will still work. Now, I always tell them that the first word is our practice run, and now we're going to check our starting place. So take your top card off. And take a look. Me, yeah, me too. We both landed on the yellow card. And so we'll put that one out of the way. Great starting place. Uh, now it's for real, and the word is time. Who wants the letter T? I do. And who wants the letter I? You do. And who wants the letter M? You do. And how about the letter E? You do. Okay. Now take your top card off and show that one to the audience. And we've both landed on the green card. It says perfect match. We are two for two. We will put those out of the way. The next word, little three-letter word, now. Who wants the letter N? I do. And how about the letter O? You do. And the W? I do. Very good. Take your top card off. Show that one to the audience. And we've both landed on the orange card. It says incredible. Now it's almost scary. Uh, the next word, a little two-letter word, is. Who wants the letter I? I do. And how about the letter S? I do. Perfect. Take your top card off. Show that one to the audience. And we've both landed on the blue card. It says it's magic. We've got one word left, two cards to mix it up. The word is happening. Who wants to take an H? You do. And who wants to take an A? You do. And who wants to take a P? You do. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, you hope that the spectator will take the P. And who wants to take the next P? I will. And how about the letter E? You will. And how about the letter N? I will. And how about the letter I? You will. And how about the letter N? You will. And how about the letter G? I will. Take your top card off, turn it over, and we have both landed on the white card. It says, can you believe this? And the last card says, this is amazing. And so this is a wonderful, fail-proof trick from Ickle Pickle Products. Packs flat, plays huge, very colorful. You can use it in schools uh, because of the spelling nature. You can use it in preschools because of the color. Uh, you can use it as a psychic effect to make all kinds of different points. And so the sky is the limit. Perfect match from Ickle Pickle Products.